Hi, I'm Matt. I'm from the Doncaster Rivers Trust. And we work to restore and protect your rivers. And today we're going to learn how to spot reds. So what is a red? Well, we have one here. So what you're looking for is usually an area of clean gravel, whereas the rest of it is quite dark and it's got algae on it. So this one's been cleaned by the fish. What you're looking for is a hump of small rocks or pebbles. And it's quite obvious once you get your eye in it. To give a bit of a background on reds, their name may have come from the old English word to clear, and this is exactly what the female fish, or hen, does. In the UK, trout and salmon spawning season usually occurs between October and January when the water is cold enough to carry sufficient oxygen needed to incubate the eggs. Trout tend to favour slopes of gravel towards the tail end of a pool. This is why we may have found this red immediately downstream of a weir's scour pool, while salmon favour fast flowing glides and riffles with larger substrate. Once the hen has chosen an appropriate site, she turns on her side and flexes her body, deflecting the water flow onto the riverbed, which creates a depression. Once the red is cut, the hen lays her eggs into the depression, over which the male will release his sperm, also known as melt. The hen then moves upstream and displaces more material to cover the eggs, leaving a depression with a raised area immediately downstream. From here, it is important that the water flow can percolate through the gravel to the eggs, allowing them to develop. It is also important the site isn't disturbed before the eggs have had a chance to hatch. So now you've learned how to spot them, it's really important to keep an eye out for them when you're going in the river and give them plenty of space so you don't destroy their eggs. Thanks for watching.